Hi everyone. Okay, here we are, online stuff. <laughs> so um, I also feel like it's just really important for our, our community to stay grounded, including myself. So I'm also doing this for me, um, you know, amidst everything that's happening and just the, the craziness that's out there right now. Um, I would like for all of us to stay healthy, calm, um, and use this opportunity. Let's let's turn this around and let's make this a positive. I'm, I'm the eternal optimist. So um, the mayor has us on lockdown, as you know, until March 31st or so they say. It could very easily go longer than that. So I'm going to make a commitment to you, um, and I hope you will join me. I'm going to say let's spend the next 30 days together. And I promise for the next 30 days, we'll be doing at least one post a day of an active workout. Um, we're looking into um, live ones as well, so that hopefully there's some more interaction. But for today, it's just posted on YouTube. Um, and thank you for watching, really appreciate it. So they're gonna be quick, they'll be sweet. I welcome all comments. You can always email me directly at natalie at havebodywellness.com. Natalie is M-A-T-A-L-I-E at havebodywellness.com. Um, and let's get started. Today will be day one of our 30 days. I hope you will join me for all of them. Okay, so as always, I like to start with three centering breaths. One hand on the belly, one hand on the heart. Inhale, fill up the lungs. Hold the breath and then sigh it out. Just let it go. <sighs> Again, inhale. An expansive breath. Such a deep breath that you feel a shift in your rib cage and then sigh it out. <sighs> Switch hands, other hand on top. Last time, make it a good one. Inhale, fill up the lungs. Hold the breath. Nice loud sigh. <sighs> Okay, we're gonna start with some forearm planking. Um, I love this ring, but I can never work out with it. <laughs> All right, so forearm planking, you can either do a tripod version or if the arms are straight, whatever works better for you, and just breathe. We're gonna inhale, right leg goes up. Exhale, flex and lower. Inhale, nose. Exhale, lower. We're alternating legs. Inhale, up. Exhale, down. Inhale, up. Exhale, down. Inhale, three. Exhale, four, exhale, five, exhale, keep your chin down, six, but don't collapse, seven, and eight, nine, last one, ten, good, let's hold it here and just breathe, keep breathing, <laughs> two, three, four, this is weird, I haven't done this before, <laughs> I'm just going to pretend like I'm counting, I don't know how long this is. Okay, and then from here, we're going to walk it into straight arms. So let's do arms straight. Try not to fall. <laughs> All right, then here, the legs are together. I'm high up on my toes. And inhale forward, exhale back. Inhale forward, exhale back. Inhale forward. It just engages the core a little bit more. When I warm up, I really like to do this. Inhale forward, exhale back. Last one. And then take it into a downward dog position. Try to keep your heels down, enjoy the stretch and breathe. Let's do a big awe breath here. Inhale through the nose. Hold the breath, nice loud sigh. Good, I'm gonna walk the feet forward. If you're not flexible in the hamstrings, just bend your knees as much as you need to. Let your head hang and then curl up. One vertebrae at a time. <sighs> Taking all the time you need, it just feels good. Okay, we'll start with heels together, toes apart, standing. I hope you're with me. <laughs> and as you inhale, come high up on the toes. As you exhale, lower. Inhale, high up on the toes. Exhale, lower. And it's okay if the heels separate from this. Arms, add the arms. Inhale, up. Exhale, down. Inhale, nose. Exhale, down. Great for balance. Inhale, nose. Exhale, mouth. Last one. Exhale, mouth. Good. This time we're going to hold. Go up. Now you can walk the heels together. Press the heels together. It really gets the inner thighs and everything on the inside. And just hold. Let's just hold it for 10, 9. If you want to play with your balance, <laughs> feel free. 7, 6, 5, 
four, once upon a time, I was really, really good at this. <laughs> Three, two, and one, and rest. Parallel position, hips width apart with that. Look down, make sure the toes are in the line, toes, knees, hips, and float down. Inhale through the nose, exhale through the mouth. And as you exhale, hollow out that belly. You can add the arms forward, inhale, and exhale. Inhale, nose, exhale, mouth. Inhale up, exhale down. I know I just switched it. Inhale up, exhale down. Well, now we combine our two. Inhale down, exhale, straighten the legs. Now we go up, inhale up, exhale, lower. Again, inhale, exhale, last time. Inhale up, exhale down. Good, taking it into a wide second. You're externally rotated, the toes are out. And side bend, exhale. Come center, other side. Come center, that's your exercise. Exhale to go all the way over. Inhale to bring it back to center. Exhale all the way over, back to center. Keep it moving. And center, and last time on each side nice and then come up those are all kind of grounding exercises along with the the breath work and in the core hopefully you're feeling the blood getting flowing <laughs> all right so we're going to inhale through the nose and exhale through the mouth for those of you that know hundreds let's start with just hundreds breath and then we'll do the hundreds so just the breath work is good. Honestly, you'll feel it in the abs and in the breath. It's great. So inhale through the nose. It's hard to do while I'm speaking. <laughs> exhale through the mouth. And that's your five. So let's inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. I'm actually going to count it out for you so you can do it. Okay? Just pretend I'm right there with you. And inhale through the nose. And inhale two, three, four, five. Exhale mouth. Two, three, four, five. Curling one, two, three, 
four, five, inhale, lower the legs, exhale, up and over. This is our last one. Stay for the inhale, exhale, curl down the one, two, three, four, five. Then flex the feet, curl up and shoulders, inhale for two, exhale for two. Inhale, inhale, exhale, exhale. Two, two, exhale, exhale. For those of you that are classically trained, this is single straight leg stretch, and I know I'm out of order. We're not doing Pilates five, <laughs> but we're doing some of the exercise from Pilates five. Inhale, inhale, exhale, exhale, inhale, inhale, exhale, exhale, inhale, inhale, exhale, exhale. Last one. Don't know how many that is. I lost count. <laughs> Take the arms up to the side, and now we do the full twist. Love this one, it feels really, really good. Inhale through the nose, touch the ground if you can. Tighten the abs before you exhale and come over. So pull those abs in. I'll say goodbye for a second as I were to take my head the other way. <laughs> Inhale, tighten the abs, exhale, pull it in, up center. Inhale to the right. Nice. I'm saying nice because it feels so good. <laughs> I'm trying to give you guys exercises that are also calming as well as strengthening. These are all movements that tend to relax my body. Inhale, tighten the abs to bring it center. I hope it does the same for you. Last time, inhale. Enjoy your stretch, tighten the abs. Last time to the left. Inhale, your left, my right. Tighten the abs. Come on up back to center. And there we go. That's that. Okay. So this one is start and plank. I like this one for obliques and hips. It's a nice hip stretch and it's a good little workout. Feet together and then cross the right foot under and let it rest. Hopefully you can see that in the camera. As you inhale, dip the right hip down um, and then exhale, lift. Two. Three, four, we'll go for ten. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Did you get that? <laughs> Other side. So let's go into plank. You tuck the left foot under this time. Inhale, exhale. Two, three. Always abs in, deep breath in, and side out. 